Hi YouTube, it's me Shady Love and I have four, four fragrances for you all today. Yes, Mache has been working for you, okay, with the fragrances. And I have three from a Dollar Tree and I have one from the Big Lock dis Discount Store. And you know they sell a lot of preferred fragrances. So the first one I want to share with you is called Rita. Rita. R-I-T-A Rita and it's an imitation for um, Ralph Lauren uh, romance and it's a very beautiful uh, box it's like a blush pink with a tint to it and let me say the notes are the ginger chamomile lemon yellow freesia and rose middle notes lily carnation wild violet and lotus base notes are exotic woods patchouli oak moss and white musk and that's um the notes for the ralph lauren romance which this reader is an imitation for so here's the bottle that it comes in uh much like all of the dollar tree bottles with the little calla lily top and the you know nice feminine shape bottle real pretty and says read on it has a little pink fluid in it okay so let me turn my fan on here and we'll get into the scent see this scent is very like alive it's very um fresh and um outdoors is it, to me i feel like you would wear this to work or just going out you know somebody call you and just out on the whim this is what you're going to grab and spray you know probably like a, a nice fresh lemony on the move scent you know so the reader would be the outfit that perfect scent for you to go to work uh, or play it's a very daytime scent very daytime scent and you can find this at the Dollar Tree, as I stated before. And it's a European American Designs Perfume, the EADs. Okay. The next one is the Flor de Paris. And it's an imitation for Ana East, Ana East by Cacharelle. On the east, on the east, and my mom used to wear that years ago, and it smells so good. It's a really pretty scent, very serious and very pretty scent. And this one, this particular one, is by the um, John Jean Felipe perfumers, and this is uh, they say here it's a limited edition. This one, so I don't know if they mean the packaging or the actual perfume. Okay. And I do notice a, uh, that this uh, bottle is definitely different because they used to have this uh, similar packaging to the Jordache packaging. But this one is um, Circle. Or I don't know if this one came first or that one came. I think this one is um, here recently. And um, to me, it, it's a little masculine. Um, what makes it feminine is just a little pink and gray seal and the actual pink fluid inside. Okay. And I'll read you the notes to Ana East, Ana East by Casherelle. Okay, um, and the notes are orange blossom, lavender, galbanum, honeysuckle, hyacinth, lemon, bergamot, black currant, and white lily. The middle notes are Moroccan, jasmine, honeysuckle, carnation, tuberose, iris lily, orris root, and yinglang. Um, the base notes are leather, sandalwood, amber, patchouli, musk, oak moss, vetiver, um, cedar, and incense. So, as you can see, the actual um, Ana East, Ana East by Casherelle has many notes. Why do we even need other perfume if it's something that has that many notes? This should be the best smelling perfume on earth. Which it is a very good smelling perfume, I would say. Um, I was trying to check that to make sure that it didn't have any scent on it. Okay, so we'll get into the scent um, of the Fleur de Paris. 
imitation for the Anna East Anna East by Casherell. And I like to spray I like to spray the scents, you know, with you all so that I really can explain um, give you guys a really good gander of how everything smells and that, you know, because I don't, you know, if something smells funky to me, I'm going to tell you it's funky, you know, or it's not that pretty or it's, you know, yeah. Now, this actual perfume smells um, a lot like the Ina East on East. It's a little bit lighter, just a little lighter because, you know, um, Ana East, Ana East is a little stronger, probably because I use all of those notes. Um, but this is a great likeness. And actually, I have another bottle. Um, this one is by the Jim Felipe Perfumers, but I think I have an Ana East, Ana East by the Jordas um, Perfumers, Jordas Collection Perfumers, and they smell just like this. So the notes in this must be um, not as um, hard to you know put together to make the, this imitation so this is a great imitation it smells very fresh and it's a very serious um, perfume perfume if you want like a really perfume that you can go out in the evening or in the daytime this is it and um, I find that a lot of the Jim Felipe's um, they stay on a long time and um, they're really bright and fresh. They have good scents to them. And a lot of them are really good, especially their, um, their white diamonds. And they have a lot of them that are really, really good. My next scent I want to share with you guys would be, this one is actually the Jordache Perfumers. And this is um, Jordache number 58 and it's the Ed Hardy Women. Okay. And those notes are blackberry, cassias, um, magnolia, peach blossom, lily of the valley, sandalwood, and musk. And that's those are the Ed Hardy woman notes. But you know Ed Hardy has a lot of perfume, so I'm not exactly sure which one this one is representing. But um, I, I picked one. Which I figured it was from the first one, but this is a Jordan number 58, and it's like a uh, they're doing a imitation for the Ed Hardy. Okay, so let's get into our scent. Yeah, yeah, this is a very nice scent. It's very, um, it's very alive and very fresh. And I find like with the Jordache scents, they have this one scent in there. I don't even know what it is. But it makes them all smell alike. Even though they may move around some other scents to make it smell like whatever um, designer perfume they're going out to um, do. They have this one scent in there that is a very, it seems like it's bergamot. And they put that in like a lot of their scents. It is just a very inviting scent where it just kind of makes all of the Jordache um, perfumes smell really, really nice. And you can find these in like, um, you know, the 99 cent store, Dollar Tree. A lot of stores have like the Jordache, um, the little Jordache dollar perfumes. The last scent I want to share with you is a uh, preferred fragrance. And I got it from the Big Lot discount stores. And I know you've seen a lot of people do this when it's a tattoo by Inky, the woman. And I do believe that this is a uh, preferred fragrance on fragrance. You know, this is not an imitation for anything. And those scents are Tropical Mango, Wild Strawberry, Ruby Red, Grapefruit, Black Freesia, Amber, and Rose. And this is a very long-lasting scent. It smells really good. And here's the bottle. I know many of you have seen the tattoo by Inky bottle with the little tattoo on it. And so let's just get a little gander. Okay. Yes, this smells very fruity and very, um, very useful, very fruity very daytime wear. It's a very nice scent. So that does it for Shady Love.
with the sense for today. And I hope you all enjoy um, my scents um, that I go out and get. Like I say, I'm doing a scent collection, and I, you know, and I'll show you my whole scent collection once I gather a few more. So with that, I'm gonna bid you all adieu. Uh, subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you. <laughs>